For your Christmas Eve, I bring something colorful like our mind. This is a Christmas tree which I made out of green LEDs which has 10 different effects. So let's see how I made it. This video is sponsored by JLC PCB. I made this LED Christmas tree to gift someone. So it must look beautiful and professional. So I made a design for my PCB. I export PCB design as Garbar file. Then I upload this Garbar file to JLC PCB's website. This is the largest manufacturer company in China. And here you can choose your PCB's color. I choose yellow, you can choose anything else. So JLC PCB are producing the common 2 layer PCB within 24 hours and no need additional fee for this and they take very few dollars to give you PCBs. Let's see how this 12 channel and 10 FX is working. This is PIC 16F 84IC. First of all, you have to program this because this is a microcontroller IC. So for programming this IC, I put this IC on my homemade PicKit programmer. If you are interested to see how I made this PicKit 2 programmer, then here is a link in the description. So I open the PicKit programmer software and it automatically detect the 16F84 IC and I erase the stored memory from the IC and choose 10 effect hex file and upload it to my IC. So you can see the RX LED is blinking. That means uploading is completed. Let's see how the hardware is working. For this microcontroller, 10 channels are coming out and the signals are very poor, which don't have that much potential to drive all these LEDs. So for that reason, I used two ULN 2003 IC, which can drive all these LEDs very easily. If you are interested to make this, then you can find these codings in my blog. And the link is in the description. After three days, I received a box from JLC PCB. And I opened the box and see there is a notebook and here are the PCBs which I ordered. This time I had ordered yellow PCBs rather than blue, which are looking more cool. So now it's time to mount all the components on the board. I used 7850 regulator IC for smooth regulation of 5 volts. And I can drive this by a 9 volt battery also. Now it's time for the most painful work. I made a drawing on a piece of paper and paste it on a block of wood with some glue. And I drill all the marks on the paper using a drill. And you need 128 green LEDs to complete this project and 5 red LEDs. Now I put those LEDs one by one in the holes and bend the pins and solder them together and take it out and now it's looking like a star. You need 10 stars like this. Now I take a thick copper wire and measure a distance of 1.5 cm and mark on it because to make proper gaps in between the stars and this thick copper wire will be the spinal support for the tree and also the positive connection for this. And now I soldered the copper stick on the board and I put the stars on this stick from the top and take it down to the bottom in a perfect position and solder it. I repeat this process for all the stars and now it is looking like this. And for connection for each layer, I used jumper wires. 
after soldering all the wires, it is looking like this. I set my power supply at 10 volts and connect this DC male socket and insert the jack in the board. And see, it is working absolutely fine. And the thing of happiness is, it is consuming 30 milliamperes while it is running. That means, you can run this Christmas tree for 10 hours with a 9 volt battery. I hope you guys like this video, so make sure to give it a thumbs up and stay tuned for more interesting videos. See you soon and Merry Christmas to all of you.